already forgotten what I wrote down. Um, I'm not quite prepared to represent the entire deaf community, interpreter community, etc. However, you know, you, deaf awareness is what you, you had as your topic. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, it was about the <laughs> Okay, so you have several questions that um, I understand that yes. we'll have answered yes. for you. So just to present them verbally Please. to everyone and that the community uh, sees that it is being brought to you fine people, leaders of the district. Um, the community is concerned and would like to know the status, when will the regional day school program for the deaf be returned to its original state. We do understand that an AI classroom has been provided to the elementary school. This is all rumored information. Um, it's concerning that there are not more parents of deaf children present. Um, unfortunately, that's because they don't know what a lot of people in this room already do know. And that's why we are here, and unfortunately, a lot of parents are not. These children need deaf role models, as the previous speaker just mentioned. They need the supplies, the curriculum, the tools that they used to have that for some reason have been taken away from them. In the community, we call that deprivation. They are being deprived of their natural language. American Sign Language is very rich, and if their education is being provided to them from their natural language, they are gonna learn so much more than when it is going through a sign language interpreter. And I know because I am a sign language interpreter, and I know the challenges that the students face when the culture is not being taken into consideration when the information is being provided to them. So again, a status update to the community of San Antonio, the deaf and hard of hearing community in San Antonio as to when will this be returned to its original state. And I understand there are IEPs that are being violated and the only one that is being honored is the one parent that has stepped up and said, this is being violated. So we wanna know as a community, why are the other ones not being honored? That is against the law. And these parents, unfortunately, don't know to speak up. Thank you. Thank you.